This is the moment that every mixed martial arts athlete hopes will materialize the number one heavyweight contender making the walk for his first title fight here in the UFC. I mean, the nerves are going crazy for this man right now. He's so nervous. Has he done everything he needs to do? Has he not left any stone unturned? He says that he has prepared. He says that his body's ready, his mind's ready. He feels physically good in the spot. He's taking on a long-rated champion. If he's gonna get this done, it's gonna take something truly special. He does not believe jitters will be a factor here tonight. He has built his career methodically to this point. We'll see if we hear the words and new by night 10. respect and appreciation as we have for the skill sets of the lower weight class athletes. There is nothing in pro sports quite like a UFC heavyweight championship fight. That is a reality. You've been there. You've done that. Baddest man on the planet putting that very distinction on the line tonight. Yeah, the champ walks again, and he wears that proudly. Johnny wants to be called the champ. He loves to be called the baddest man on the planet. He is so skilled. He's so dangerous. He's so scary. And he gets up for these types of challenges. He intends to never let go of his belt. He understands the challenge in front of him here tonight, but he has been forged by this training camp, the championship experience he has accrued, and we'll see if he can lead the way he enters as the greatest heavyweight in the world. All right, with that, the weight ends here. Both fighters have graced the octagon, and we are raring to go from a sold-out Eddie Hot Arena here in Abu Dhabi, UAE. Our tail of the tape for this heavyweight championship fight. Now for the official introductions, here's Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. <laughs> Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner, presenting the challenger, the warrior. And now, introducing the champion, fighting out of the red corner. Ladies and gentlemen, presenting the reigning, defending, undisputed UFC heavyweight champion of the world, Vicious. All right, Herb Dean, third man Ready in the octagon fight? for this one. Ready. Ready. All right, pretty visuals in every direction as we return to the stomping pass. Oh, flying knee to the head. <laughs> nice shot there by the champ. Watch the strike there, counters with a jab. Almost in range with the straight left, but that's a mess. Oh, heavy kick downstairs. All right, gets inside, gets the single collar tie here. Able to land there with the straight left. Best punch in the game. Beautiful jab. And these guys have some chins on them. Huge shots being landed on both sides. Bunch over the top. These boys are going at it. Oh! oh! So more output, at least in the early going. <laughs> Trying to find a home for that right hand. Nice job to get inside and get the single collar 
other time. All right, so now blood is a factor. You see that he has been opened up in that eye area. Yeah, he's got hit in the eye, and now there's a cut. But it's nothing to worry about too much now. But he's got to be very careful with it as we go forward. Nice combination of kicks. Way to hide that leg kick. Just over three minutes to go. Gets in close and gets that single collar tie locked in tight. Well, I'm no fighter, but if I rock a guy to that extent, I feel like I'm closing the show. Absolutely. You got to go close the show if you get a guy hurt that bad. You cannot back off and pick the time. He's right for the picking. Go and pick the fruit. <laughs> oh, nice. Oh, big elbow. Try to establish that jab. Leg kick is there. Oh, nice counter jab there. Just over two minutes to go in round one. Is my favorite strike. Go after the cut. Unable to connect them. Sneaky oh. body kick lands up in the elbow. Oh, nice combination there. He is just killing him with volume tonight. Jab, right hand, body shot, and kicks. What a masterful show of different techniques and ability to throw a combination. Head kick, that's a miss. Oh, he's staying busy here, connecting with a barrage of punches. Oh, nice counter, yes. All right, champ, now we're starting to see some bruising on that thigh. Pretty good job attacking that area tonight. I mean, this guy is digging his shin into hit the five. What a tremendous performance. Now some separation. All right, 45 seconds now to go on the round. And there's that jab. Oh, and a head kick there. So we cross the 30-second mark in our opening round. Superman punches true. Oh, straight punch. Oh, he's hurt. He's hurt already. Back. Final seconds of round one. Horns out for the end of round one. All right, so there's the horn signifying the end of the round, and that is one of the best five-minute stands as you will ever see from a fighter. Rocked him multiple times, unable to get him out of there, but came pretty darn close. He did come close to finishing the fight, but he didn't get it done. Now, it will be on him to try and stay patient, try to find the kill shot without overextending himself and putting himself in trouble. All right, so there's the horn signifying the end of the round. A stunner there with the head strike midway through. Nearly got him out of there for good. Almost got him out of there. He hurt him badly. He had his opponent hurt real bad. Ready now his fight. opponent's walking back to his Ready. corner. Everybody looks confused. They don't know what they're supposed to do to try to change the way that this fight is going. Oh, inside kick. Just a gorgeous shot there to end the fight. Really just the way he drew it up. He found the opening and capitalized on it to the utmost extent. Nicely done to finish the fight.
Bruce Buffer is in the octagon with the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean's called a stop to this contest at 18 seconds of round number two. Declaring the winner by knockout and still the undisputed UFC heavyweight champion of the world, this time. Well, DC, you know what it's like to be the UFC heavyweight champion. It's not the easiest belt to defend. Kind of made it look easy tonight. I mean, that's why the belt changes and changes so fast. Things change so quick at heavyweight. But with